Gubernatorial candidate Beto O'Rourke is in South Texas and expected to make several stops across the valley today. One of those stops includes Edinburgh, and that's also where we now find our Jeremiah Marshall. He's standing by live at the Annex Building with more on this visit. Jeremiah. Hey there, Daisy. Yeah, so we just got here, and you know, if you take a look behind me, you can see that there are many supporters here with their signs. We've also been seeing people and hearing people honking and chanting, and they're also waiting for Beto's for arrival, which he will be here around 12:30 this afternoon. And you know, the supporters here—they are with their signs, T-shirts, and much more. But this morning, Beto O'Rourke and his team made a stop in Corpus Christi at the Nueces County Courthouse, and today he's encouraging families, friends, and loved ones to head to the polls, especially during early voting. And if you didn't know, today is the last Monday for early voting. Beto is expected to touch on several different topics today, such as women's reproductive rights, gun control, and of course, the importance of voting and letting your voices be heard. Now again, Beto and his team are expected to be here in Hidalgo County. He also will make other stops across the valley, and this includes Wessico, San Juan, McAllen, and more. Now we are going to continue to monitor this area as we wait for Beto's arrival and we will have live shots throughout the day. Reporting here in Edinburgh for NBC 23, I'm Jeremiah Marshall.